Go select the plane which you want to sketch. And draw a center rectangle. Click OK. Give the small dimensions based upon your requirement. Exit the sketch. Go to the features. Click extrude boss and sketch. Give the required amount of thickness. Click OK. Evaluate the dimensions of your rectangle. Then you have to sketch a circle. Give the dimensions based upon your requirement. Click OK. Exit the sketch. Go to the future. Select the extrude boss and select our circles to be extruded. Give the required amount of thickness. And click OK. So, first we have to edit the extrude boss 1 to make the plane in the middle select the mid plane and click ok after making this edit we have to mirror the circle so click the circle to be mirrored and click the mid plane After making a mirror, we have to add the fillet. Click OK and give the fillet between the intersecting of circle and rectangular face. Make sure if it is uh, on the keep surface and click OK. Now our hammer main part is created. Then we have to create the handle of the hammer. Make a doom on the both faces of hammer's main pot. Click OK. Then we have to make the handle on the hammer. So click the mid plane. and draw the profile of handle as a circle exit the sketch go to the futures click the extrude boss and click our circle to be extruded give the required amount of the length of the handle to attain a shape of the handle we have to add a tapper and mention the degree of the tapper. Now our handle is created. Click OK. Then we have to give the fillet on the edges of the hammer's handle. Before that we have to give a specified graphics properties such as appearance and color click 
click OK. Select the boss extrude and give the color for the handle. Click OK. Then we have to add a fillet on the edge of the handle. Give the dimensions based upon your requirement and click OK. And our handle is ready. So finally we have attained the shape of the hammer.